Hey guys, my name is Dr. Shornell Wolverton Sihan. Happy Sunday. We have a meeting here in a few minutes, but I wanted to pop on because I heard something really cool this morning when I woke up and I think that it will help hopefully support you guys a bit in this season that we're in. Um, I heard two things and got some expansion on it um, for today, 2-24-23. I heard the cloud is lifting and the timeline is shifting. The cloud is lifting and the timeline is shifting. Um, so uh, when I woke up with that sentence, I started looking into, and this is kind of the impression that I got in some, just the whole download is those who have been feeling like they're in this like dense oppression type, really thick kind of energy. Um, I don't know if any of you have been there. It's been an interesting time for me anyway. Um, and maybe this is just for me, who knows, but usually anything that happens to me is because I have been assigned. Bob Jones used to always say that whatever you get, meaning me that I needed to share because that I, I was born as a sign and this, um, for the season. And, um, anyway, so what I felt was to, this is an amazing time for inner work. This is a really, really important time for inner work. And I just encourage, I encourage as in strength, you to continue any inner work that may be needed or required in this time, especially because March, there's some things coming up that we have to be ready before we get to try. Mm, I choose to be ready for. So um, if you've been feeling like there's been like a cloud or any kind of oppression or really dense type stuff, dark stuff, just feeling like lethargic or no motivation, almost like paralyzed, um, depressed, depressed, oppressed, suppressed. Do not stop the inner work. What I heard was Galatians 6, 9. Let us not become discouraged, meaning no courage, in doing good. For in due time we will reap if we do not become weary. So do not become weary. This is a time to remember your love, to remember your courage, to remember your strength. Galatians 6, 9 said, so let's not get tired of doing what's good. At just the right time, we will reap a harvest of blessing if we do not give up. Again, don't give in, not giving up. This is an important time for us to not give up. Um, and then Galatians 6, 10 said, so then... As we have this opportunity, let us do good to everyone and especially to those who are of, who are of the household of faith. Now, yes, we are to love everyone. Household of faith. That word I looked up, household of faith, and it has to do with those with the same kind of connections, the reliance on Christ consciousness, um, those who walk in um, faith specifically and fidelity which is integrity so who you are hanging out with again is super important all the time um it's extremely important because the other thing that i heard was this is a time of relationships relationships so the cloud is lifting the timeline is shifting and so are relationships we are seeing relationships. We are experiencing relationships, but this is okay. It's all good. Everything is good. Um, I just want to encourage you guys to really go within and not go out. I have made that mistake here recently in this time for myself. I'm just being honest of, you know, really looking outward for support or guidance or, you know, just anything, a lifeline and, this is where the kingdom of God is. This is the kingdom right here within us. And um, so I, the, what came to me is there, there shall be no other gods before me. And so I recommit and I encourage any of you who need to recommit to recommit because the kingdom is in here. So there should be no other gods before what's what source says within you and your cells and your heart. March will be big. Um, this is a great time to be ready to find your peace, to remember your peace and remember your love and, um, and to really look at who you're, who you're with and, and to really love well, everyone, everyone be light and light, be light and radiance and love 
and truth to everyone, but especially to you. Seek ye first the kingdom, and then all these things will be added unto you. So I have a meeting like right now with our members, and you're more than welcome to join us. Um, there is a membership uh, link. I think I'll need to put it up here if you want to join us. It's going to be from 2 to 3, 3.30, um, a Zoom. And um, I just want to say I love you and um, appreciate you so much for all of your love and all of your essence of who you are and all of your individualism, all of your divinity, all of you that I love so much. And I just um, wish you a happy Sunday. All right. Talk soon. And some of you, I will see you in the meeting. Yay. All right. Talk soon. Bye.